Today's question is how to do documentation estimation in Agile process. Most important question for me is why do you want to do estimation? Who wants it? And above all, how do you do your dev and test work estimation? Because I can see a complete flow in your system in your Agile adaptation process. Why? Why I'm saying so? Because we don't do estimation of development tasks, we don't do estimation of testing tasks, we don't do development of, uh, do estimation of documentation tasks separately. We do relative estimation of the user stories during planning meeting, team sets with the product owner, they pick up the user story, they estimate the user stories. Yes, they can use different processes or methods to estimate the user story. Uh, like uh, uh, you can use a Fibonacci number, you can use purple card. Uh, so many methods are there which you can use to estimate your uh, user stories. So it's a very wrong process to do uh, to estimate uh, development tasks, to estimate testing tasks, or to estimate the uh, documentation tasks. Oh yes, if your problem is that you are a technical writer for more than uh, one team, or you are working for a two or three team, uh, I will uh, suggest you rather than uh, doing estimation of our documentation uh, separately, uh, it's better uh, you start following uh, something like Kanban or Scrum Man, uh, like you can make your own separate board, in your task board, uh, there you can track your work and estimate your work separately. Otherwise, uh, there is no point in estimating documentation work. Uh, it will really, in the long term, it's going to hamper your design adaptation. Thank you.